Oh he's gonna hit her! He got oh, he ain't, he ain't. He ain't. This is a certified hood classic. What's good, family man? It's your boy Quizzy Man. I'm back, man, with another video. And I just wanted to let y'all know, man. Big thank you, man. We're at 60, excuse me, 86. <laughs> Had a little dyslexia going on there. I just got it backwards, but I'm just 86,000 subscribers, man. We're so close to that 100K, man. I cannot wait to slap a big plaque on the wall, man. Basically, where the, where the sign left. You know, we had a sign up over here, and that was destroyed. That, 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 that was destroyed. But y'all can make a difference by helping your boy out, man. Make sure you hit that like button and go down below. Subscribe to your boy if you're new. If you've been watching, you're like, yeah. I don't know. I don't know about him. He's a he's a freak. Just join. Just help your boy. All right, man. All right, man. Let's get it. Let's get it. We already got BS. Here we go. You know it's gonna be some BS with him crying. Dude, what's wrong? Nothing. Just leave me alone, okay? Dude, you've been. All right. Goodbye. <laughs> Out of it, Allah. You don't know what he wants. It, is he really crying or is he being manipulative? You just don't know, bro. Sammy, you just don't know. Crying since lunch break. Something's going on. Boy got milk in his <laughs> locker. That essay that Garrison assigned us. What I want to be when I grow up. I don't like thinking about what I want to be when I grow up. All right. <laughs> Why though? Like, what are you talking about? Because when I grow up, I want to be something that I know I can never be, Stan. <laughs> Here's the manipulation. We know what you're going to be. A bum. At one point, you might have a wife and kids and little kids. and it, he was, a, But he's going to be a bum. He's going to be a bum. We need a part two to that pandemic episode. That special, bro. <laughs> Cartman, tell us. <laughs> I want to be a NASCAR driver, okay? When I see the car races on TV, those loud engines and peeling wheels, it's so cool. <laughs> <laughs> so why are you crying? <laughs> Carmen, if you want to drive NASCAR when you grow up, you can. Oh, right. Right. Someone like me can be a NASCAR driver. Right, because he's fat. Look at me. He's fat. You really think someone like this can ever become an awesome, famous NASCAR driver? No, because you're fat. Well, he is fat. <laughs> Aww. I'll just talk Carmen, to shit. you can change things about yourself. No, I can't. I'll always be like this. <laughs> Dude, no, he will always be fat. That. Come on, you guys, I have to face facts. NASCAR is only for poor and stupid people. I don't have what it takes. And there it goes. And there it goes. What? I'm not poor and stupid enough to do NASCAR, and I never will be. Dude, I don't think just poor and stupid people like NASCAR. Oh, really? Hey, hey, kitty. Huh. Oh, no. It's a some Yeah, dude, I love NASCAR, boy. You, you walk right into that, boy. Come on now. Look at Kyle, he mad. You are poor and you are stupid. I know you're trying to make me feel better, Kyle, but a rich smart kid has no place on a racetrack. A Dude, rich so smart retarded. kid? Thanks, Dan, but even if I was, I'd still be too rich. How are you rich? Your mom pays for everything. Uh-oh. Here we go. You guys really think I could do this, don't you? You really believe in me. I believe that you're a you're an idiot. And maybe I can make myself believe it, too. Thanks, you guys. I'm gonna go chase a dream. He is so damn delusional. It don't make no sense. It 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 it's he's so delusional. It's hard to be mad at him because he he gets it, but he plays like he doesn't get it so well. I don't even know. He just might not get it. It's an asshole. Butters, hey Eric. Butters, Butters. You guys have been talking to me, and well, they got me pretty pumped up. I'm psyched, Butters. I'm about to do something big, and I'm psyched. Well, I'm psyched. <laughs> you ugly. I need your help. Can you get psyched? You gonna get psyched up? Yeah, I'm psyched. Get really psyched up, butters. I'm really psyched. Yeah. Wha yeah, let's do this, all right? <laughs> I'm pumped. I'm psyched. All right. Boy, I look like Conor McGregor. Boy, he's doing some. Yeah, yeah. I'm really psyched. Yeah. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. What are we psyched about, boy? Watch, watch. I'm gonna become a NASCAR driver, butters. I'm going for the gold. NASCAR. NASCAR. I know. I'm not going <laughs> stupid enough, but I can change that. Butters. NASCAR. I want you to take all my money. Every nice. minute, Butters. Fifty-eight dollars and thirty-two cents. I'll you take it all. Give it away, all your money. Just get rid of it, Butters. Don't tell me where you spend it, and don't ever let me have it back. From this moment on, I am poor. <laughs> Butters, like, all right. Are you sure you want to do this? I told you, I'm serious, Butters. This is my shot. I'm gonna get as poor and stupid as I possibly can. All right, folks. We want to thank you all for coming out and supporting. Just NASCAR. an idiot, bro. Woo! Cool. 
Now Look at Kenny. Saturday's big race. <laughs> we are really. Oh, wait, wait. Are these the poor and stupid people, bro? That don't make no sense, bro. Like, why they had to do them like that, bro? Come on now. I'm really excited to be part of the fastest growing sport in America. <laughs> Is it now, really, I don't know though? about you, but I'm thrilled to watch NASCAR finally becoming recognized as a respected, legitimate sport. <laughs> You know, I've never really been into NASCAR. I know that you NASCAR people don't have very much. So I went out and oh bought you God. all $58 worth of canned food and blankets. You're he, welcome. He has a heart of gold, bro. Me. I've helped the <laughs> kitty. Well, go what, grab that shit. Dogs outside. <laughs> Mostly cats. <laughs> bro, if you want to get stupid, all you got to do is react, watch reality TV show, bro. That's, that's it. Just watch... Just watch every reality TV show you can from 2010 all the way up until now. You'll be you'll be dumb as hell. I'm telling you. Go ahead. I just go ahead. wish I'd brought an umbrella. Hey, Eric. Ah, uh, buddies. Did you give away on that many? Yep. No, he ain't got no knees. Look, you're you're poor as shit. Like, what am I supposed to do? How come you're hanging upside down? I need problem. to get stupid, buddies. <laughs> I'm getting all the blood to rest of my head and watching a marathon of two and a half men. Hey, that's a hot girl over there. <laughs> oh, Barney Fife, boy, got touched, boy. <laughs> Barney Fife finna touch him, boy. Charlie Sheen always looked like a freak in everything. Sure, she's hot. She's wearing a sweater. <laughs> <laughs> Feel stupid yet? Not yet. When a woman isn't feeling her freshest, she turns to Vagisil. Ah, God oh, damn God. it, another Vagisil commercial? To stop feminine itching and relieve vaginal odors. Oh, what? really? Oh, stinky ass. Like stinky vaginas? If you develop an allergic reaction, see your doctor. In some cases, Vagisil can lead to short-term memory loss. For the freshest, cleanest feminine area, do whoa, what whoa, other whoa, women whoa. do. Did you hear that? Short-term memory loss. Oh, my God. In, In some, some cases, cases Vagisil, Vagisil can lead to short-term short memory loss. Oh, my God, butters. We need Vagisil. <laughs> He's just Vagisil, so stupid. Vagisil, Vagisil maximum strength. Vagisil you ain't got no wipes, money. <laughs> Vagisil medicated wipes. Gee whiz, there's Vagisil everything. Which one do I use to kill brain cells? Well... Just buy me one of each of them, Butters. I'm buying? I'm totally poor, Butters. Did you forget? But but I I, I didn't bring any money. I didn't know I had to buy that just here. God right, damn you it, spent Butters. all his money. All right, just just keep a look at it. I'll try it here. Look that way. Make sure to help the needy. What is he finna do? Oh, you're not supposed to eat it. Look. Oh, no, you're going to die. That's death. That's death. No, that's death. Is anybody coming? That's no, not death. Okay. That's death. Okay, little boy, what are you doing? <laughs> boy, you look like a Las Vegas stripper in the face. Oh, my God. Butters, I feel kind of stupid. <laughs> really? Yes, yes. I'm feeling totally stupid right now. That well, you bad. should, son. Let's get out of here. I'm ready. I'm ready to be a NASCAR driver, boy. That's... They are out of pocket. South Park be out of pocket as hell, man, for the shit that they We are do. just seconds away from the start of the Denver 300. The it's Denver you, Broncos. Mr. Evans, sir, your, uh, your wife is on the phone and she just got What? Yeah, she what? got and you got to go talk to her. A lot? <laughs> a lot. Boy, you stupid. <laughs> He's so damn dumb, bro. I don't even think Butters know what that means. Oh my god! Right, what could be going through Sweet, his head, nice work, bro? Butters. Now go be my spotter so we can win this thing. Bro, do you know how to drive, bro? Hey, are you sure you can do this? Don't worry, Butters. I'm totally poor <laughs> and stupid. I'm ready for NASCAR. <laughs> He's taking Let's more badges. Let's go, NASCAR! His feet can't even reach the damn pedal. That's why I'm like, bro, what are you talking about? <laughs> I'm not moving, Butters. I think you gotta push the gas pedal. What's that? There's like a long pedal on the floor by your right foot. Okay. Thank, thank the, thank God he got Butters. Well, I guess I'll be a little disappointed if I did. See him just start taking off and then immediately start driving. I'd be a little disappointed. Like, how, how the hell does he know how to do it? So they, South Park can't win with me sometimes. You know, I know that. They know that. You know that. Oh, no. He is Looks gonna like kill somebody. Car is going the wrong way. No, backwards, more the wrong way. Oh, no. Here we go. We're gonna have to blur some shit out. Watch, here we go. Here, this is it. Oh, maybe not. 
Oh, wow. Excuse you? Eric? Oh, no. Yeah, I'm about to say he's done. How'd that <laughs> work? All the effort I put in, I still wasn't poor and stupid enough to win. Oh, Eric, stop. you were as poor and stupid as you could be. Don't you yes, you can. It's never going to happen for me. Those people are way more poor and stupid than I'll ever be. I might as well kill myself. Eric, don't ever talk like that. I've given away all my money, drank enough Vagisil to kill every brain cell I have. But it still mm. wasn't enough. For torn ligaments in both knees and a level two concussion. He also God. appears to be developing three small vaginas in his stomach, but they are all oh. sparkling clean. Well, Damn! Just pull the plug on me, doctor. I don't want to live like this. What? You aren't on life support. Pulling a plug wouldn't do anything. Boy, you got that... I don't know, boy. I just can't tell what the hell that nose is. That's... Remind me of Tesla or... True religion. I don't... Rock jeans. Damn donkey bus. You look like You're lucky Hitler. to be alive, young man. Sneaking onto a NASCAR racetrack and hijacking a car for a joyride? That has got to be the stupidest thing I've ever heard of a kid doing. Thanks, mm. Doc, but you aren't going to make me feel any better. No, really. Of all the idiotic, dumb ways I've seen kids injure themselves, <laughs> yours takes the retard cake. Oh, wow, that, bro. Eric? Okay. See? You are really stupid. Could it be? I only lost the race because I somehow wasn't poor enough. It has to be. Shut right. up. <laughs> Eric, where are you going? Get me my coat, Butters. That don't hurt. This thing again. You got a broken foot, a broken leg, bro. I don't like how Butters looked just then. Like, he looked like a freak. Like a freak. Like, he'll touch Caillou, bro. Butters, Butters versus Caillou. <laughs> Next Butters on Fox 11 Caillou. News, are NASCAR fans stupid? Some people are starting to wonder after a NASCAR fan apparently got high on Vagisil and snuck Come onto on. the track, killing 11 people. Was he Tom really high, though? Maximum strength Vagisil and mm. also Vagisil medicated wipes making mm. NASCAR fans look pretty stupid Tom the NASCAR I didn't even understand what you said bro I ain't again, gonna lie. But this time he'll win I understood that you know here's my thing just fix over the cracks and and clean up the couch. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, why is the laundry clothes over there? Like, who who does that pile of laundry? Actually. Y'all can't see, but there's a pile of laundry right over here. I might be born. Look at that stuff. I'm talking shit. What is he doing? Cartman, he going to Cartman House. Oh, he's pissed. Oh, hey, Kenny. Come here, dude. I want to show you what I've been working on. Check it oh, out. What? I thought I could just give all my money away and be poor as your family. But then I realized, what do poor people do? Buy things even though they don't have money by going out and purchasing things that are 0% down and no payments for two years. That's how you people stay poor forever. Am I right? Oh. That's it, right? Oh, wow. <laughs> Kenny, I'm just trying to get good but at NASCAR. But is he lying? Hey, I love NASCAR just as much as you do. Oh, it's so easy for you. How you know, Kenny? I've had to become poor all on my own, you know? I wasn't born with a plastic spoon in my mouth. Oh, uh, you... The reverse that they be doing, bro. The reverse. Uh, that's why I love South Park, too. Because in everything, you know how all the movies, TV shows, everything be cliche. Because you be like, I wasn't born with a silver spoon in my mouth. You know, you know that people are going to say that. But you don't understand what South Park... You don't know what South Park is going to say. You know they're going to say something off the wall. But you can't quite put your finger on it. And then when they actually do it or say it or something happens, bro. Then you be like, you have to... You, you couldn't do nothing but laugh at it. Like, you have to respect the fact that it it seems so simple. Like, ah, oh, if, if you got a lot of money, silver spoon. If you don't got no money, plastic spoon. But it's not as simple as you think to think of that shit. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. I'm, bro I'm breaking it down just because I love it so much. What? I had to go just buy stuff with zero because I had no okay. payments for two years myself. I didn't have parents to go do it for me like you do. Look, Ken Shut Kenny, up. Kenny, we shouldn't be fighting. We both love NASCAR and we're both poor as shit. <laughs> He's like, why are you uh, touching me? me? Eric Cartman. Damn, Eric, Abraham Lincoln. My name is Jeff Hamill. I no, your name is Abe. <laughs> Honest Abe, bitch, you lie. I'm the CEO of Vagisil. Holler. Uh-oh. Young man, your NASCAR stunt has brought a lot of attention to Vagisil, and honestly, I don't know how to thank you. Our They're sales are up money. and women are finally realizing that their feminine odor can be treated. 
I first created Vagisil for my wife, Patty. She's my muse, my flame. We realized that NASCAR can do a lot for product recognition, and so Vagisil has a little present for you. They go give him some money. Oh, nice. Okay. Oh, sweet. Now that's no lit. Way, this is so tits. Uh, SS. I just okay. would like you to represent us in the next NASCAR race. Dude, check it out, Kenny. My very own NASCAR. <laughs> and we've hey, modified man. the cockpit to be operated properly by a child. That's horrible. That that's actually horrible. Like 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 no, they need to be sued. That they need to go to jail. Oh, cool, huh, Kenny? Honest hey, Abe been lying. I got a NASCAR, Kenny. So awesome, huh, Kenny? Huh, Kenny? <laughs> uh, glass. We are now <laughs> live at the NASCAR press conference where the drivers Kenny just of Saturday's it. race just are gearing it. up and taking questions from reporters. So, uh, what's your guys' take on the track? No, what's wrong with your face, boy? That boy been asleep for three weeks, Hear bitch. Any concerns? Well, I think it's a fine track. You know, the, the techs have done a really good job of making sure the banks are grafted down to the right specs and there shouldn't oh, be any problems. Yeah, we got the track yet. We got to graft in banks and specs. It's like an oval. So we're going to drive straight and then we're going to be turned into the lamp. Oh, <laughs> uh, they're saying hot weather tomorrow. Any concerns about restrictor plate or brake fade problems? Of course, any time you're dealing with high humidity and temperature, you can compensate what? your brake fluid, but the plates themselves... Compensate your brake fluid and get your, get your <laughs> brake working so you can stop some dead. <laughs> Why are you talking hey, Excuse me, who is this kid? Is he even a driver? <laughs> Ew, bring it on, Eric Hart. You scared of the competition? I'm Fight him, Tony. poor and stupid as you. Tony, beat him up, Tony. <laughs> I'm going to go fast and I'm going to turn to the left sometimes. Can we just get back to the subject of racing, please? Oh, bring it on, Danica. You dumb bitch. Think I can't steer left better than you? <laughs> oh, my you God. This really dude is stupid. stupid. Thanks, me buds I really think I can hold my own against these guys. A little worried about that Jimmy Johnson guy, though. He seems dumber than spit. And that Danica Patrick chick? Phew. We're going to need to get even poorer and They did nothing. Buddies, both of us. They did nothing. It was your fault. Look at him. Just right, getting drunk. What did this man got sick? This man was smoking cigs at the bowling alley. Well, we now turn to the world of NASCAR. <laughs> Maybe People Kenny was not sure what to think of NASCAR are more sure today after a NASCAR driver released bigoted and ignorant statements on his podcast. <laughs> oh God! All right, what's up, NASCAR fans? I don't know about y'all, but this are you drunk? Obama is pissing me off. Uh -oh. I'm gonna do some dip and speak my mind. Today I'm gonna be dipping Vagisil regular strength into itch cream. Oh, yeah. Uh. yeah, that's a big digger right there. So I'm pretty pissed <laughs> off what I found out. Bro, chewing tobacco is disgusting, bro. If you do that shit, stop. Stop. You got to hit with the pull on the end. Stop. I understand that, bro. Like, if you got chewing tobacco and you slide it in like Stop it. Fat my fans, boy. Come on, man. Just stop it. Spitting and shit. Well, come on, man. That shit is disgusting. If you're going to do it, smoke. Get your cancer from the... St stop. St stop. That's... No. That's not good. No. Don't do that either. Don't smoke either. You know. Don't do no tobacco. Don't... Don't do anything. Don't do nothing. Weed doesn't... It's not considered as nothing. Weed is something. I don't know. Okay. I found out this Obama wants to put a bigger tax on gasoline. I bet. What the oh. fuck was that? That's what the fucking gay. He needs what? To be gay as hell. You all know my pit boss, Butters. Well, Obama's gay. He's <laughs> gay oh, as hell. Pissing oh me God. off. So y'all be sitting there. He's a pissing me off. <laughs> wow. Yeah, Kenny ain't playing. Watch. Kenny go get his own car and watch. I, I bet you. I Stage bet you Kenny go get his own car. Could be the most important race or sabotage the NASCAR it. Year. Lots of speculation and interest in the Vagisil car driven by Eric Cartman. We're joined now by the inventor and owner of Vagisil, Jeff Hamill. Thank you, Chris. <laughs> Jeff, Abe Lincoln. why did you decide to sponsor a NASCAR driver? Vagisil really is glad. very excited to be part of the NASCAR phenomenon, Chris. You know, I first created Vagisil to try and help my wife, Patty. Why does he keep... <laughs> Mentioning his wife, she just like, come on, bro. Was it that stinky, man? 
man walking around with a stink bomb. Man, look, you need some pants on. You ain't gonna wear no more dresses today. She is my muse, my flame. My Wherever flame. Patty goes, her smile lights up the room. Her vagina, on the other hand, clears the room and makes it uninhabitable for weeks. Oh my God. Okay, well, the race is about to start, she has so why don't we kick it back say. down to the track? You know it's true. Start your engines! When you know something true, you just gotta take it. You just, uh, hey, all right. All right, start your engine. What's that mean? Call that him. means you flipped a switch that says engine. Is he stupid or what? Yeah, he's a champion, all right. <laughs> Check your bag, please, sir. No, no, see, this won't do. Oh, Can't no. Bring a sniper <laughs> rifle onto the track. How the hell did you get it in there? What kind of clown car bag is that shit? <laughs> it's man some. Ah, uh, ah, uh, nah, nah, boy. They got that Mary Poppins bag. Oh, me... come on. Look, NASCAR's trying to change its image. It's people You're like you that are giving NASCAR okay. a bad name. <laughs> That's that Harry Might Potter be able to bag. in the gift shop. Oh, wow. Boy, had to. This a Quidditch the game, ain't it? Slowly headed out to follow the pace car. Yeah, I know all about it. I like Harry Potter. So what? Yeah, I'm gonna press the gas pedal and I'm gonna go forward. Oh. He still don't know how to drive. This is just the pace lap. You don't go full speed yet. Yeah, just the pace lap. I'm gonna hit the hit the brake. Oh no! What are you doing? F you, Danica Patrick. You ain't half as dumb as me. Gas pedal. Oh wow! The car. Oh no, girl. You better get out of there. Son of a bitch! Ooh, ain't nobody can stop me. And it looks like the Vagisil car has already clipped two other drivers and taken them out of the race. Yeah, the other drivers are not <laughs> going to be happy about this. What do you He's think? He's gonna Mr. take Hall? everybody out. Vagisil is a company that really stands behind its product, Chris. Nah, you gotta watch out for him, bro. He don't give a damn about nothing. He knew exactly. He's smart. He knew exactly what he was doing. He knew that that boy was dumb as hell, but he had ambition. He wanted it. He wanted it. He wanted. He wanted to go be stupid. He's a freak. No, he's a freak. I say a lot of people are freaks, but he's a freak. Anybody with this beard that goes around like that and it connects up at the top to your ears, the mug is going past his ears, going inside his ears. He's a freak, bro. We want women to know that Vagisil is effective, safe for use every day, every day. Oh. Every oh. day. <laughs> she stinks. <laughs> and available nationwide. Stinky bitch! Oh shit. Dry hands. Careful up here about a hundred yards, Jack. There's a wet car on the right Sorry side. You're gonna wanna watch for it here. You're gonna wanna watch it all around the He's gonna hit her! He got he, oh, he ain't shit! He ain't you shit! Danica Patrick tried to get in my way! That pisses me off! That's fing gay as hell! Oop, I'm coming up <laughs> on that turn thing again. I got to stay left! What? Oh no! What are you doing? I'm gonna have to blur all this out. There you go. You're back on the track. They look. They surprised. They like. What the hell is going on? Oh lord. Kenny. Kenny is the best person to do this. He can't die. Get out of my car, Kenny. Come on now, friend Kenny's trying to break the windshield. Ain't that just hell. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, no, you got I'm a, uh... <laughs> In my head, I'm like, I'm like, oh, man, the guy made it. The car flips over on him, bro. No, that's We're a wrap. Paint. Yeah, that boy turned into a chicken nugget. Boy, you're done. That's a wrap. Kitty. I have to prove myself. Who I heard you lose move? a lot of weight being in them Sorry, cars. I'm winning this race with the brake. Bye, Kitty. Oh no, Kitty, no! <laughs> okay, great. Well, it appears that in season one it would have been a wrap. <laughs> It would have been a wrap in season one. Season one all the way up, what, to season 10 or some shit, bro? He was just getting murdered. All the other it. drivers have crashed and only the Vagisil car remains. Looks like you're going to win, Mr. Hamill. This is such a great day for Vagisil, Chris. That's Our good. Our product awareness will be at an all-time high. No, it's Feminine not. Feminine odor must be treated diligently 
very diligently. <laughs> she gone. She left, Patty. bro. She Patty. got tired of you. Oh wow! It looks oh, like Patty. a woman is trying to take over for Jimmy Johnson's car. What? She got tired of that. She, wow! You are on an active racetrack. This is extremely dangerous. Let me. Bro, 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 bro. She has been beaten down and brutalized verbally psychologically by that man, okay? Every chance he gets. He talks all that shit about her. So imagine what they don't say, what what they say in private. Cause he just talks that shit publicly and openly, boy. And if she stinks, she stank. But just keep that shit between y'all. Tell her to keep that shit between her legs. Hey, talk to her. You stink, bitch. Pat are they having a Daddy, cookout? You are my muse and my flame. They're neck and neck approaching the finish line. That ain't gonna work, buddy. She ain't gonna be manipulated. That's a wrap. Oh, ass again. Okay. They're gonna need a tow truck. <laughs> Big celebration look. for the Lowe's Home Improvement Team. You know, she just dancing around and shit. You know, she's the whole room stank. Patty, I'm We know what's you. up with you, Patty. You ruined us. You ruined Magicin. No, she didn't. No, no, Kenny, go ahead. I deserve it. I thought I could just waltz onto a racetrack and do what these people do. Right. But I owe you an apology. The truth is, I'm just too smart. And with how oh, smart I am, I'm always successful and therefore have money. <laughs> I just have to accept I'm too smart and rich for NASCAR. Time for me to give it up. All right, butters, give me back my money. Huh? The I ain't no money. The 32 cents I gave you, I want it back. But, but you, you said I had to be fair on the, on the, but I can't even try waiting back, but you, but now I should get back. That, 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 what? Be in debt, boy, just like the Chinese, boy. He ain't even Chinese. Anyways.